Hey y'all, thanks for tuning in today. I have a real quick DIY update kind of um, for a Walmart wreath that I have had for about, I believe six or seven years. So I kind of just want to update it, give it a fresh new look. Um, so I'm going to do a real quick tutorial on how to do that. Um, everything that I bought is under $10, so let's get started. Okay, so first starting off, this is my wreath that I am going to be giving a new update to. Um, it has a few different pine cones and um, some brown bells on it and some little... Um, I guess branches is what you would call them and then some older berries that you can see that some of the red has fallen off on so I'm just gonna do a real quick update on this I have the items I'm gonna be using to update it again this uh, wreath update is under ten dollars um, so first off I got this ornament it is an ornament um, I actually I actually got this I think the same around the same time that I got the wreath um, this is I think I paid under two dollars for it I'm just going to tuck this little string behind his hat and just wrap it around to kind of hide it on the wreath um, so you can't see it if you can see it let's see there it is okay so I'm going to uh, be tucking that behind there so you can't see it while it is on the wreath. The other two items that I got are these little swirly, um, these little swirly picks and they actually have a clip at the end. So I'm going to be using these. Uh, this makes it real easy to just, uh, just attach them to the wreath and then um, if you want to remove them later to give it a different look you can so I got those in the buffalo check and then I also got these which are the burlap curlies and um, they have the clip as well uh, both of these were a dollar 48 each so I got three of the burlap ones and two of the buffalo check ones. I wish they had one more of these, but we'll make do. Okay, so first I am going to just place uh, these picks around the wreath. And just find a spot where you think it'll look good. And then you're just going to push it down in there to where it attaches to the wreath. Let me undo these a little bit. And then just kind of hide it a little bit and then let's see I'll put one over here and just kind of play with it and then we will put one let's see one right here I guess I should take the tags off Okay, so I'm going to uh, place the burlap ones around as well. And I'm going to do one right here. And then we will do, I'm going to move this one down a little bit. 
And I'm actually going to put it this way. And then we will put the other buffalo check one up here. And just kind of uh, fluff your wreath to kind of hide those clips. Mine has got smushed by the door so many times because we have a storm door on the front door. So just kind of fluff it. And then I'm going to be using this ornament um, to put just at the bottom of this wreath right here. And um, it kind of just stays on its own. I kind of move at these little sprigs around it to kind of stay there on its own. And okay, so there you have it. Um, like I said, this little uh, wreath update was under $10 for everything, um, not including the wreath, of course. I already had that. Like I said, I've had that this wreath for about six to seven years now, um, but I know just plain ones at Walmart um, are really cheap, really inexpensive. Um, so you can spruce up any kind of plain wreath to your liking um, using these things. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give us a big thumbs up and we'll see y'all next time. Okay, so here is the finished product. This theme right here, the buffalo check in the burlap. Um, I did this theme last year. I really enjoyed it. So I went ahead and just stuck with the same theme this year. Just changed up decorations throughout the house. But I hope you like this video. We'll see y'all next time.